thought to film this because I'm going to be straightening my hair. Now I'm scared I don't want to damage my hair and I know like, you know, putting excessive heat onto your hair of course damages the curl. But before I do that, I want to make sure, look at these curls. What I decided to do was a protein treatment. So I'm going to be using Olaplex, the number three, to basically protect my hair from all the heat damage that I'm going to basically put on my curls. This is going to hopefully save my hair. It's rare that I straighten my hair, as you guys know. I only straighten it once a year, and I always recommend you guys not to straighten your hair, especially if you're starting your curly hair journey. I mean, straightening your hair is going to prolong the process of your journey. Let's just say that. I straighten my hair once a year. And normally I just do a blowout, but with this, I'm actually going to be using a flat iron and slowly glide the pro iron from roots to ends using even tension. Continue both sections until your hair is completely smooth and sleek. So I'm gonna be straightening my hair for this job. Getting paid basically to have my hair straightened. I mean, I couldn't really pass it up. So, here we go. So I'm gonna be using the Bounce Curl Clarifying Shampoo um, just to remove any oils and build up from my hair. I'm going to use this Curly Co shampoo brush. Get in there, massage, and cleanse the scalp. Okay, so next I'm going to use this cream conditioner. I actually just put like this much. Next, I'm going to use a white tooth comb to basically take out all the little knots. You always start from the bottom, by the way, when you like start detangling your hair. You don't start from the top. You just work your way up. So it's so much easier doing it this way than starting from the top down. All right, see how easy that was? My hair is feeling nice and smooth. All right, so now I finished washing. I put conditioner in my hair and now I'm going to add the Olaplex. And I'm gonna section my hair off first and then we're gonna get started. Dry your hair completely with the Pro Dryer and the Smooth Pass Paddle Brush, keeping the airflow pointed downward for a smooth finish. Right once because you already see all that. 
I just don't want to do too much. trying to adjust i've been getting compliments that i look younger i've been getting compliments that i look middle eastern i don't know i just i like that i can look different you know i've done so much to get to this point and that's why i don't recommend you guys to strain your hair but i did it because i know what it's gonna take for me to get back so as you guys been watching my journey now you're gonna see the journey continue. Do my treatments. I'm probably gonna do another Olaplex treatment after this, um, just to add that extra protein in my hair. You know, I didn't just do it just because, but I would just rather get wigs. To be honest with you, I really wanna try a lace wig, even though a lot of you guys are gonna be like, Jazz, you don't need it. No, I don't need it, but you know what? I like to switch it up, and I just feel like that would be a protective style, you know, wearing lace wigs, having your hair braided up. I would do a deep conditioning treatment when I have my hair in a wig. So just like, you know what? I might try it just to have my hair straight or have a different style. Who knows? Thanks for watching. I hope you guys learned something from this and I hope you guys do not strain your hair, especially if you're starting your journey, okay? So don't do it. I just did it, but doesn't mean that I'm advising you to do it. All right?